Hello. This caterpillar is just starting to make its chrysalis. It's July 30th, 2013. It's almost 5 p.m. in Chicagoland. And this caterpillar was in a J position, but now it's straightening out as it pulsates. The skin should split at the bottom, which is its head. The antenna are limp. He's straightening out. Really pushing that skin up the back. You should, oh, it's splitting. You can't really see. Let's see. Here we go. Let me move behind. There's the skin splitting up the back, and it'll go all the way up to its rear end, which is attached to the top of the container. There's three other chrysalises beside it. So this is the fourth monarch in this container that will become a chrysalis. I'm going to go back a little bit. This whole process really just takes a couple minutes. He's been hanging in a J all morning, or all day, I should say, since it's five o'clock now. Move a little bit more, a little closer. It's been drizzly and it's just, oh, it's warm and humid. It's about, it's probably close to 80 degrees today. It's overcast though, because we're on my back porch and this is the same temperature as outside. So here the caterpillar continues to pulsate, pushing that skin. So long stripes. This is real time, so it really just takes a couple minutes. That monarch caterpillar is wiggling, trying to release itself of that skin. Come on, you can do it. <laughs> this season has been uh, really a bad one for the monarchs. Monarchs have been scarce. A lot of people are posting on various sites asking questions about their absence. I think a lot of it is due to last year's drought. Okay, come on.
Good job. All right. Success. This brand new green chrysalis will become a butterfly in about two weeks. Now it needs to just kind of settle and harden. It'll continue to pulsate um, every now and then. And after an hour, actually even after 15 minutes, it starts to look more beautiful than it does now. And after an hour, it'll look just like these. These, are, these were made a few days ago. So here are three beautiful chrysalises. You can see the gold band, some gold dots. Here's a few empty chrysalises on the other side of the container. Right. Well, success. Hope to see you as a happy butterfly in a couple weeks. I'm just going to move around a little bit. And just continue to settle. The gold band will form. And it'll be in good shape. Okay, thanks.